Hi guys and welcome to 123MyIT's tutorial on how to jailbreak your iPhone. Uh, so I tried this about six months ago and could never get the, um, it to work but apparently Apple has relaxed um, their, their general uh, rule on whether you can jailbreak your iPhones. Um, this is one of the original iPhones, it's the, um, it's the 3G uh, iPhone, um, it's one of the very original ones and basically I'm just going to show you how that I've been successful in trying to jailbreak it recently um, so as you can see just a general iPhone um, nothing too flash about it if we just uh, there's two things that you've got to remember before you do it is you've got to go into your settings menu uh, and then into your general menu and uh, you've got to take off make sure your auto lock is off and then your passcode lock is also off Alright, so once that's done, go up to about, and then you've got your version number here, and this version number is pretty important. I'll try and give you a, get you a little bit closer there. It's a bit hard to see on the video. However, the version number is 4.2.1. Okay, now what we need that version number for is we're going to actually um, jailbreak that particular version um, with, a, with a program called Red Snow. I've already downloaded Red Snow and you'll be able to get the download for this uh, from my website. Alright, so you run the, re the um, Red Snow and then it comes up here and it says, let me just move that to the side there, it says jailbreak and install clear. So we'll run that now. Yeah, so as I mentioned before, I tried this previously to jailbreak it um, through various options, but what I found is that this option actually works quite well now. Um, the, you know, why would you why would you want to uh, jailbreak your iPhone? Uh, basically, there's a, a lot of good stuff that you can install, um, which you can't actually get going um, via the the, um, the Apple Store. Things like remote desktop. The reason why I wanted this, is, um, and I'll show you in another tutorial later on, but I can actually install a, a program called VNC, um, which it gives me access from my PC to my iPhone, um, so I can remote connect to it. So once that's done, it'll say Red Snow. Make sure you've got your um, your your cable plugged in there, and you're ready to go. Install Clidia, enable battery uh, percentage. Now there's a whole heap of other stuff here. Um, if you want to jailbreak your phone, obviously it's at your own risk. Um, or, um, and uh, I wouldn't, wouldn't recommend it if you're um, not 100% sure what you're doing. But generally these days it, it seems to be pretty easy. Um, you know, you can only break it if you if if you know something goes horribly wrong. But you should be able to just restore it back. So if something doesn't work or it's not working or hasn't hasn't installed the Clidia, just um, make sure you back up your iPhone first, and then um, before you before you go and jailbreak it, if anything does go wrong, you can always just restore it via iTunes. All right. So now it's just said install Clidia. So I'm just going to go next. All right. Da -da 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 -da. All right. It says please make sure your device is both off and plugged in. Okay. So I'm just going to turn it off. Holding down the power button and slide it. All right. If it is not off, plug in the device first. And hold down the power button, yada yada yada, and do the slide. Okay. Click next when both your device is when both is off and plugged in. So, so it's plugged in there, as you can see, uh, and it's also turned off now. All right. So we'll just go next. All right. Now you have to put it in DF mode, mode, which means you need to hold down the power button and then hold down your home button. For, this is for 10 seconds, so it will actually count down and get it and then it says releasing the home button but, but keep holding down your power button alright okay no device detected okay occasionally this happens uh, I'm gonna just try it again just give me one second <coughs>
Okay, welcome back. So we're going to just try the um, DF mode mode uh, again. So basically, once it's powered off and we've still got it plugged in, then we can hit next here. All right, hold down the power button for three seconds. Without releasing the power button, hold down the home button. Okay. Without releasing the home button, release the power button and hold the hold the home button for nine seven six seconds okay and you might be able to see it there now it says waiting for reboot all right now all these files are obviously um, I'll, I'll put them up on my website so that's one two three my it dot com you can go there and you can um, as you can see there you now it's saying downloading jailbreak data all right bangity bang so it's just installing everything on the bit of software here it actually says that it's done and this is just an old iPhone that um, that I've kept uh, I'm, I've actually upgraded to iPhone 4 for us, um, and I'll do a tutorial on that, a separate video on that one shortly. Um, I've also been able to jailbreak that one, and it's uh, actually the reason why I did that is because I was um, uh, wanted to use VNC for doing some tutorials. Um, however, this this old phone, because uh, Apple have upgraded it, it, it sort of doesn't really work very fast anymore. So it's not very quick between the applications. So trying to remote into it doesn't really work very well. I mean, it works, but. Um, yeah, it's uh, it, it works much better on the on the newer phone. So I'll, I'll show you that in another tutorial. So if you just um, have a look through the other tutorials on my website, that's uh, www.123myit.com, um, and uh, you'll see also the the downloads, uh, the jailbreak downloads for this phone as well. So it's just say flashing NOR here at the moment. <coughs> Now this may take a little while, depends on the speed of your iPhone. Um, what I try to do with my tutorials is I try to go um, sort of step by step without stopping the video too much. Um, the reason why I do that is, is so you can actually see what's actually happening. And, and you know, some people they do tutorials and they sort of they skip through it, and if you get stuck at a certain point, then you don't really know what to do next. Um, so it's just saying there, installing bundles. All right, now, now this uh, iPhones are generally reviewed a few times as well, so you can see it's just restarting there now. All right, but this version was done with uh, with, a, with a version of software called Red Snow, um, and I'll make that available as a download on my website. Alright, and as you can see it's come back up there now. So if I actually just slide it along, alright, and what we're looking for now is this Glidia uh, icon here. I'll show you that a bit closer. Alrighty, it's like a brown icon, very similar to the App Store icon, except it's a brown one, the iTunes Store. If you hit press on that one, and that will bring it up.
All right, you can see it all loading. What it will do now is it'll actually install all of the Clidia stuff. Um, and your, your phone is now jail, like, pretty much it's uh, it's been jailbroken or jailbreaking. You can't really say jailbreaking in this in that and um, as you can see, it's sort of downloading all the packages and things there. Try and get a bit of a close up of that. I don't know how good the pictures come out, but you get the idea anyway. So that's pretty much how you do it. Um, the reason why I was doing it is because you can actually go in once this is loaded it will reboot, it will restart your phone. Um, you can log into it again, go down to your search button down here and you're able to search for for apps just like you would on, on iTunes. Um, and as you can see it's, uh, it's ready to go there. So let's see if I can actually do anything or whether it will reboot. Sometimes it reboots, sometimes it doesn't. V. N. C. Let's see if this works. Alright guys, and there you can see it's uh, VNC. Alright, so that's pretty much it guys. Um, so like I said, have a look on my website, see what you think, leave uh, some feedback. Um, if I've helped you out, leave leave some good feedback and uh, hopefully uh, you don't have any problems and uh, um, if you also, if you need any help, just um, feel free to drop by my website uh, and drop me an email or, or leave, a, leave a comment there and I can try and help you out as much as I can. Okay guys, thanks for that. Bye bye.